Fantastic. And we know that in Manchester, um, the rapper organisation, and I think WASP was at the meeting, demanding that there's no collaboration with community organisations and NGOs with the voluntary returns programme. There's no such thing as voluntary returns. Anissa just described the family returns policy, which has been boasted about, but now as a result of it being brought in, less families are being detained. And that is shocking. It's because it all rests on detention and forced deportation. What else are you going to do but have to go back? So these things cannot be put forward. And I'm really glad and I hope WASP will take it up with Women for Refugee Women that that is not being proposed anymore, that Women for Refugee Women and the other charities that are advocating that policies like the Family Returns Policy are a model that should be rolled out to everyone. I know you're looking shocked. We've given you a leaflet. We've given you a leaflet, but it's really important. We hear how what sisters and brothers doing, grassroots people fighting together, but over and over again, organizations that are meant to be supporting asylum seekers have actually stood against them, including the rollout. Everybody used to be entitled to benefits and social housing. And it was charities who said it's not realistic to expect asylum seekers to get that anymore. And it was charities that said, when we campaign against illegal aid cuts, let's not mention immigration. It's a toxic issue. So it's time to stop that now. And I'm really glad and really look forward to hearing what WASP in Manchester have to say about this, because we can't let this go on. We can't be fighting at one end with women coming to the, uh, uh, I'm from Women Against Rape, you know, coming to us, who are in the family returns policy, terrified, getting on a night bus because she's had a letter saying she's got to go back. And she's got on a night bus thinking that's it, they're coming for her that night. That's the family returns policy. And it can't be that charities that say they're speaking for women asylum seekers are saying that that's a success to roll out. So it's really, really important time to stop and time to have them on our side, not on the other side against us. Yes. Thank you.